What is going on YouTube? Lamont on the run. Today we're at the Mall St. Vincent here in Shreveport, Louisiana. Let's go see what this place is all about. Anyways, did anybody see this story of uh, Aaron Carter's mom, Jane Carter? Well, if you haven't seen this story, so Aaron Carter, who's been dead for at least five months now, he died on November 5th of 2022 of what it looks like to be a accidental drug overdose. Well, so why do they think that this was an accidental drug overdose? Because he was found in his bathtub floating in the water with a bunch of prescription pills all around him and cans of compressed air, like I guess computer cleaner. He was probably huffing that. So Jane Carter, his mom, posts these crazy pictures online of the scene of his death. She's calling it a crime scene or something like that. You see this weird picture of what looks to be feces and soiled underwear on the floor. The bathtub water, it's all green. I mean, I don't know how long he was in the water dead until they found him. Pretty grisly to say the least. And I don't know why the mother would want to post these photos online. It's kind of sad, you know, <laughs> I'm 43 years old, so I know a lot of people younger than me, when they think of Aaron Carter, they think of like the drug addicted weirdo with tattoos all over his face, but I still think of uh, Aaron Carter as the, that little 12, 13 year old kid that was jumping around doing concerts with 20,000 people. This guy was a big deal. He was uh, almost like a... Justin Bieberish a little bit. I don't think people remember that or know that. If you're 30 years of age, you wouldn't know how popular this kid was. I mean, he was the brother of Nick Carter, who was in the Backstreet Boys, who was immensely popular themselves. And I don't know what the hell happened between Aaron Carter, 12, 13 years old, and Tattoo Face Junkie. But I believe his mother wants to say that that's some kind of a crime scene and that he was murdered. Now, there's a messages on his phone. I guess he was having some interactions with a drug dealer who uh, there was some texting back and forth saying something about he owed the drug dealer $800 for some kind of unknown substance. I have no idea. And I don't know if you guys have ever seen what a body looks like when it's been in the water for a long time, but it's pretty bad. So, uh, from what I've read online, uh, he was cremated a few days after he was found dead. And uh, his twin sister, uh, Angel, has his ashes. So, I don't know what they're going to do with him. I don't know if she's just going to keep him in her home or they're going to bury him with her sister. I have no idea. But a uh, very weird story. Very, very sad Man, sometimes, you know, you get all that money when you're a kid. You get all that money when you're super young and it goes to your head. And I don't know what his home life was like, but it doesn't sound like the Carter family had all of their um, screws in order, so to speak. So I don't know. Uh, leave a comment below. Tell me what you guys think about this whole thing. Okay, guys, I got to get out of here. I will catch up with you later. I'm going to go to City Gear and get some new clothes. Just kidding. I'm going to Salvation Army. I'll see you guys on the next video. Have a good one, guys. Peace out.